There is plenty of fall fun with your local Forest Preserve District. Here with the details is Lisa Sprinkle. Welcome to the show, Lisa. Hi, nice to be here. You're here often. I have to ask, as we go into a season of transition, what is your favorite season? I really think it's fall. It is. Because of the leaves changing, and there's just so much beauty at the forest preserves with the leaves. And if you go to Homer Lake to our um, Maple Sugar Grove, when their peak, it, it like lights up. It's just gorgeous. Yes. And then do you find that there isn't many things to do when it gets cold, or would you say no? Oh, no, there's, there's still, still a lot of things to do. And it's a totally different way to view the preserves if you come out in the snow or in the cold. Um, with the leaves gone, you can see so many different things, and you can see the um, animal tracks in the snow, and just a lot of, it's a different experience to come. Yeah. So I definitely encourage people to still come out. Well, let's not get too far ahead <laughs> of ourselves. There's no snow on the ground right yep. now, but there are leaves that are starting to change colors, and a lot of fall fun activities. Share with us with the Champaign County Forest Preserve dish. Yes. Our, um, Coming up this weekend on the 12th, we have our Harvest Fest at the Museum of the Grand Prairie in Muhammad. That's part of Lake of the Woods Forest Preserve. It's from 2 until 5, and it just kind of contains all things fall, where you will, you can do peel apples, you can shuck corn, you can carve a pumpkin, you can paint a pumpkin. Um, so there's just a lot of different things that you can do. Um, for the pumpkin carving, if you reserve a pumpkin, um, actually by the end of tonight. If you reserve a pumpkin um, for $5, it will be there for you, or we will have limited supplies there um, the day of. Did you did you uh, paint these? I these did not. The Museum and Ed Department did that, so they're very crafty and very, very artistic. And if people come out, then they will have an opportunity to paint. Yes, they can own. paint these little pumpkins um, or we'll have the bigger pumpkins that they can carve also. Okay, and would you say that this is adult friendly too or would you say oh, it's, it's definitely, um, yes. it's definitely adult friendly and it's just fun to go around and see and not very many people probably know what a corn sheller is or an uh, industrial sized apple peeler and things like that. And there'll be some storytellers. We'll also have hay rack rides. Um, so people can come out and do that and go around the preserves on a hay rack ride. Oh, you don't get to do that every day. No. Um, <laughs> I will tell you what does not look kid friendly, uh, but more adult friendly <laughs> is this glass right here. Tell us about um, what this represents. Um, this glass is for our Buffalo Trace Whiskey Hike, which our, um, the Forest Preserve Friends Foundation is putting on on October 20th from 2 until 4. Um, again, it's at Lake of the Woods Forest Preserve, and it's at Buffalo Trace. So Buffalo Trace is one of the bourbon whiskeys that people can sample. Um, people, the tickets are $55, and when you get the tickets, um, when you come out, you'll stroll across, along um, Buffalo Trace, which is our paved trail there in Buffalo Trace Parade. Yes. Um, so and there will be different stations that will have different bourbons and whiskeys, and then um, you'll learn some about, from our natural resources or operations staff, some of the restoration projects and things that are going on at the Forest Preserve. So many fun things happening there. Was, <laughs> did we miss any of the big events coming up? Or did um, on Monday the 14th, we do have a seed collection going on, and it's Indigenous People Day. So, um, again, it's at Lake of the Woods. <laughs> okay. And um, if you come to the Museum of the Grand Prairie at 930, we'll have a small, a short educational presentation, and then we'll go out to Buffalo Trace to collect the seeds that will be used in future restorations. So many fun things. <laughs> yeah. Well, if you are interested in learning more about these upcoming events happening with the Champaign County Forest Preserve District, we'll connect you at ciliving.tv. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you.